forged from the debris thrown out by a cosmic collision over four billion years ago, is an object so mighty it creates the tides on the Earth and can sometimes turn day into night. Which object possesses such power? Is it a dwarf planet? Is it a black hole? No, it's our mighty moon. So how is it possible that the moon can turn day into night? The moon's elliptical orbit around the Earth is slightly tilted. And from time to time, this tilt brings the Sun, the Earth and the moon into a perfect line. When this happens, observers on the Earth get to see special events called eclipses. When the moon comes directly between the Sun and the Earth, we'll see a total solar eclipse. When the eclipse begins, the moon starts to move in front of the Sun. Viewed through special equipment, it will look like a hungry moon is slowly taking bites out of the Sun. As the moon continues in its orbit, it will cover more and more of the Sun until eventually the Sun is completely hidden. With the light from the Sun blocked by the Moon, day becomes night, and all of the animals and birds head off to bed. But their naps won't last very long, because the Moon whizzes about through space at over 3,000 kilometers per hour. And so, just minutes later, the Sun will be visible once more. Solar eclipses aren't visible from everywhere on the Earth at the same time, though, because the Moon's shadow only falls on a very small part of the Earth. What about the other case, when the Moon is lined up behind the Earth? This kind of eclipse is called a lunar eclipse. Here, as the Moon moves into the Earth's shadow, viewers on the ground will see something equally eerie. Instead of the moon disappearing completely in the Earth's shadow, its color instead appears to change to red. It's nothing spooky though, it's just science. Sunlight is made up of a rainbow of colors, and as sunlight passes through the Earth's atmosphere, all the colors are scattered. Blue light is scattered the most, and red light the least. This means the red light can travel through the Earth's atmosphere and out to the other side to cast an eerie red glow on the Moon. Eclipses aren't the only thing our Moon causes. It is also responsible for creating the tides on the Earth. The gravitational pull of the Moon causes the Earth's oceans to bulge out on both sides of the planet. These ocean bulges, combined with the Earth's rotation, create the ocean tides. So the next time you're out surfing, you can thank our mighty Moon for producing those wicked waves. Surf's up!